This year's Power of Africa rally will be flagged off officially on May 5th at the source of River Nile by the State Minister for Sports, Peter Ogwang. <laughs> Day event will then traverse four repeated sections in Buikwe district before climaxing on Sunday 7th in Jinja district. FMU President Dipu Rupaleria has more. We are going to do sections in the sugar cane but more closer to the Buikwe side after Mabira. So both sides of uh, the plantation, you'll have the, 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 the sugarcane plantations on the left after Mabira and also on the right, which are Buikwe and Jeru sites. Um, they're going to be doing repeated sections there. Five sections on day one, which is Saturday, and then they're also going to do day two. Now, day two is going to be the other side of Jinja. Kamuli Road into the plantations and coming out around Kakira and part of the Wairaka stage that they did previously for the shakedown. And there's also going to be a super special stage for the first time at Bujagali, what used to be the Bujagali Falls, on Sunday morning. Valeria was today handed a 180 million shillings check by Vivo Energy at their headquarters in the industrial area. The FMU president, who was franked by his secretary, Irene Brick, says the sponsorship is good enough to see them through the event. It is going to help us quite a bit. Sometimes your wish list vis-a-vis -vis what you actually get, you know, they, you will never sometimes achieve what you want on your wish list. So, but whatever we have got from Vivo and whatever we get from our other co-sponsors, we have to make this event work. Larry driver Ronald Sebuguzi was also handed a 50 million shillings check to support him through the season. Me, Sebuguzi, I'm going to defend my position. I know I'm going to put the pressure on those guys. The Power of Africa Rally is the third leg of the Africa Rally Championship. Sam Bozak, the NTV Sport. Mm -hmm.